All right, here we have comics here. The next episode of Hill Comics, transgender hate mail, homosexual hate mail, atheist hate mail. Basically, me reacting to a bunch of screen caps on YouTube and DeviantArt that are response to comments I made against these Deviant lifestyles and a few other things. Trigger warning. If you don't like what I'm saying, go ahead and turn off the video. Don't lie and say there's no, there, there's hate speech in my video because there is no hate speech in my video. It's speech you hate. That's a different story. Because you don't want people getting things wrong and me trying to straighten, uh, help straighten them out and they're being angry that I'm doing so. Let's continue on here. Uh, I said, someone says, if you're not female at birth, a female at birth, you're not a female, period. Point blank, I said what I said. I uh, liked that one. Mm. So I said, okay, correct. Shut sure, up, Golden. Mm, gosh darn it. Mm. Um, you know, face palm emoji. Mm, you know. And someone says, hey, Cox, I know you're just speaking your opinion. I feel like you're getting really defensive over what you believe. Mm, of course you have to. Mm, you know, because mm. yeah, people are saying it's wrong because I, I, I say it's wrong. Mm, you know, well, 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 this evidence right here shows it's right. And I'm like, oh, well, well you don't, don't show us that. Mm, you know, shows that. Anyone anyway, here? Uh, you need to realize that just because you don't believe it's right and have evidence that shows it's right, not right, it doesn't mean that others will. Yeah, that's true. Mm -hmm. We won't believe it's right, but if there's evidence that it is right, <laughs> we all have our beliefs and opinions, and some people have it differently than you. Do you? It's true. Mm -hmm. but yeah, they got it wrong. Though. You think you can state your opinion, but you're being so defensive, it's creating a lot of unnecessary drama. Uh, you know, black heart. Try to keep dot dot dot. Mm -hmm. No, mm -hmm. continue to fight against this nastiness. So uh, people are getting this wrong, and it's just. It's, it's, Dangerous. Mm -hmm. yeah. Someone says, I, someone says, I agree. I try to like my phone hates me. Someone says, I don't love my butt off. Do research before you speak. Oh, you know, do, do, do. I got really word. Mm. You search me like before you speak. Mm. I'm not the research you don't like. Mm. Not that stuff. Mm. Shows off the word. What, what's going on? It's wrong. Yeah. Someone says, Yep. Mm. And someone says, Hugh Cox, he, lots of love, HRT, and maybe surgery, the home replacement therapy, mm. poison, and then maybe surgery. She, hey, she threw lies. Mm. Yeah, like, no. Mm. no it's, it's, wrong. it's wrong. Next. Mm -mm. Let's get that guy up here. Uh, there we go. Mm -hmm. Through lies. Mm. And so I say, yeah, Hero Cox, yes. I mean, one with nothing makes you a Ken slash Barbie doll. <laughs> and so I says, you know, science, be where that, all caps, science, be where that means weak, you know, female, be where that means weak, be where that means uh, slave, and be where that means annoying. I'm like, yeah, science you like. <laughs> Not science you don't like. And so I says, I, and then I quote this person saying, Hero Cox, he, lots of love, HRT, and maybe surgery, she. Like, I, actually, I say, actually, the gender reassignment surgery turns men into neutered men, not women. It does. I'm sorry. Mm -hmm. You know, so it says, you know, Hero Cox, holy stuff. Is your skull a mile thick with truth? Mm -hmm. yeah. mm -hmm. Do legitimate research that we like, mm -hmm. not just go on Fox News and rant about it on Twitter. Mm -hmm. I did legitimate research. I saw what, you know, the diagrams of what is a male, mm -hmm. what is male reproductive organs, diagrams of what is female reproductive organs, and I'm sorry, mm -hmm. you know. There's more testicles, is physically male. First one with ovaries, is physically female. That's how it goes. Can you on here? Uh, so it says here, guys, you don't want to be on the wrong side of history, you know, the side of talking the truth. Everybody's you know, leaving lies, you know, you don't want to be on that side. That's not the wrong side. <laughs> it's the right side. You know, on here. And I say, I, I say, um, I would gladly be if the right side is it goes against the ways of God. I don't. Mm -mm. It was here, Cox. Read it and weep, mm -mm. but no, no links to anything. Mm -mm. No links. Mm -mm. And I quote this other person, Hero Cox, well, let's talk Christian to Christian. I believe in the big man upstairs and his son. People who are trans do their best to look and be whoever their brains demand. Mm, they can't control it. They can't be comfortable skin no matter what. That's why transitioning is a thing. Saying people are gender. Right? Uh, there's, there's a saying, he's this, you're still gender and will never be other gender or sex. And still be, never be other sex, which is true. Mm -hmm. You want to hear? Oh, no, I didn't get it. Mm, shoot. Oh, we got the rest of that quote. Well, let's go. Another one. I quote another person. She doesn't want to be a girl. Her sex is boy. But her gender is girl. Like, it's like I say because he thinks clothes are what makes a man a man and a woman a woman. When they are not. Mm. Then I quote someone else. Your God, gender dysphoria is different. They simply like things that girls like. When you're a boy. It's constantly feeling horrible in the body you're in, like because of fear. Mm. I say. Mm. Your God, I am a Christian. It's for the LGBT community. So you're getting it wrong. Mm. So I, I quote the person. Uh, especially trans people. There's so much hating against trans kids because they're lying, and it breaks my heart. I was the why they preferred for now lies because that's who they are through lies. Mm, honestly, if God intended the children to be what they're born with, then why did he decide to make them trans? He never, no one, he doesn't make them trans. Mm, mm, mm. They're like this for a reason. You shouldn't discriminate. The mm, da da da. Mm, mm. 
And someone says, you're, I, I quote someone, you're a disgusting person for not fully accepting that boy. The story is now a girl through lies. <laughs> you know, no, 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 not. Stop trying to make people you know, do stuff that only make you happy. And other stupid idiots. Stop thinking for yourself and just shut the F up, please. You know, they stop showing us this truth. Mm, you know, mm, the F head is a YouTube, this F head is a YouTube channel. Mm. Well, yes, I, I say, why? Well, yes, I do have a YouTube channel. Mm, da, da, da. But uh, I say, subscribe if you want to see more. <laughs> you know, mm. I remember that. Mm, uh, next, I quote, some, I say, next, I say wow if only brain waves if it's only brain waves then you have even less of it to support your claim you're talking about the way someone thinks aren't you then he has fallen for a stereotype of how a girl thinks mm -hmm. and so we'll cause no imagine okay that you're born a girl you know you were a boy through lies mm -hmm. you know you're not supposed to have ovaries in a period but you do mm -hmm. which is wrong mm -hmm. well no not that you have it that you think you shouldn't have it mm -hmm. um, if you're born with ovaries then you go and have it mm -hmm. Testicles, you ain't gonna have it. That's how it goes. Mm -hmm. Imagine that everyone calls you a girl, but you're not. That's kind of annoying, right? Now, transgender people are born that way through lies. Mm -hmm. you know, they learn that over time. Mm -hmm. and it hurts them. Mm -hmm. Pain, you've ever felt your skin, they feel that a hundred times. Not all, about the same amount of times. Mm -hmm. Because it's all the same. It's all about how we look, mm -hmm. how we're perceived by others. Mm -hmm. And that's more than just sex. It's everything. everything. So, I'm sorry. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Mm -hmm. You know, like uh, I say, I did, and judge me. Go ahead. It's part of being Christian. When I say, judge me. Go ahead. You're being Christian. And so that um, you're like, wow. It only took you like two hours to think of this and listen. I don't judge, not because of religion or because of free people get mad or because I'm not being such a uh, it's time again. Um, screw people over in the South of the Civil War, Nazis in World War Two. If you don't move at the times, you'll be left behind. Don't. Uh, this one says, also one last thing. Here I go. Nowhere in the Bible does say no one cannot be trans. Mm. I say, I have no problem with being left behind by shifting sands. Also, I found some other things, messages from people before yours. You just cause section needs some work. Mm -hmm. You know? And someone says, Yeah, we can agree on that. <laughs> you guys, yeah, we can agree on that. Then uh, someone says, Hugh Cox, I'm just saying, would God want you to judge others that God made? Mm. I do not know why he had done it, but his reason, you need to trust him. Mm. Uh, not when it's oh, people are lying. Mm. And uh, you, know, you, you just you know, say, it. It's a good idea to remind them that they're, they're not supposed to be lying. Mm. That's supposed to be lying. And this one, nice, uh, then someone says, Hugh Cox, I believe God made the universe for us to explore, discover not just things around us, but within us. Mm, yeah, but uh, stereotypes about what is male and what is female are not mm, right mm, mm, to believe. Mm. Uh, mm, more testicles, that's a male. More the ovaries, that's a female. Therefore, if you feel something that you think is male, mm, you want the ovaries, then it ain't mm, male. Mm, if you feel something that you think is female, but you want testicles, it ain't female. Mm, so, yeah, mm, mm, you know, it's just feelings. <laughs> Everyone has feelings they have to deal with. So that's how it goes. And I quote someone, here we we'll One last thing before I go. Where in the Bible? Where in the Bible? Nowhere in the Bible does it say one can act not if he's trans. Actually, there are a few verses against it. Deuteronomy 22, 5. A woman will notice not where men's clothing, nor a man will wear clothing for the mm, da da da. Mm. And so I said, what Bible are you reading from? I'm like the normal one. Mm, you know. Your cox also, oh, do you feel the same way about plastic surgery? And like and someone who with all caps says, Can you get it through your closed mind to school? They can't control what they feel, you know, yes, but they can choose to react the way to react to it. Mm. They choose to say, uh, no feeling, mm, you're wrong. Mm. You know, gotta focus on what the Bible says, what science says, what you know, what the doctor says. It's all cool. Mm. You're wrong feeling. Or they can give in to that stuff. Mm. You know, mess themselves up bad. Mm. You know. As I do, this, uh, this person says, this is why Christians get a bad rep. They keep telling the truth. Mm -hmm. you know, it's because of people like you thinking that your morals should be the law. Mm -hmm. you know, and thinking that it's time to make people's minds more miserable by telling the truth. <laughs> Waking them up to reality. Mm -hmm. you know, yeah. uh, here goes, are you stupid by telling the truth? Like, uh, no. Mm -hmm. <laughs> It's like someone says, or not what's not in her chest, his chest. Mm -hmm. Here goes, stop being a uh, jack dude. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. like, shut up you're not smart i say you're not smart mm -hmm. he's a she's us us a girl okay through lies mm -hmm. not trying to be an expert you're probably some 12 year old little girl who learned this stuff in health class so you learn the truth and you're telling it to us and uh because you're probably a child mm -hmm. <laughs> yeah. well um can you can you actually you, did you uh you're saying oh uh, god why do, what does biological sex have to do with it? <laughs> That's the role of what you say. You're probably some 12 year old girl and who learned this in health class. Like, what, what, what would it matter <laughs> biological sex wise if I learn if I was born with testicles or ovaries? Uh, you know, how would that affect um, what I say? <laughs> you know, the stereotypes, stereotypes. Don't take the little baby, little girl's.